on occasion, water we, area. we hold barbecue dinners at the house. That should have been the whole trailer right there. We hold barbecue trailer er, trailers. We hold barbecue dinners. That's it. Yeah, it was pretty hype. Um, I, I realized after like I saw it this morning, the the trailer. I realized I was like, what in the world was the music though? <laughs> Where I, like you know, I couldn't even like make it out. They hunt for food, compete with each other, even Smoke cooperate. It. So she's like sitting down in what looks like a claw. They enjoy participating in activities like that. So... And the feeling is mutual. After all. I'm actually going to put the subtitles on. Just to see what we kind of missed. It's always possible certain familiar faces will be missing from the crowd the next time a similar event rolls around. Some things come up. And since it pertains to Cyrus and Sino, I deemed it essential to inform you all. It was. Oh, okay, not that Cyrus. <laughs> not that Cyrus. Was a great plan shrouded in secrecy. We all gathered around. And I was like, I was like, why is Sino here? I was like, what? Really <laughs> wondering what exactly Arlie is doing with all that glitching and stuff. Yeah, like, what does that actually mean? The like, for real. Evil of our Lord. Like, what does that actually That's do? How gained my power. The old man. Wait, go back. Iris and Sino, I deemed it essential to inform you all. It was a great plan. Oh, they don't in secrecy. We all gathered around and celebrated the revival of our Lord. That's how I gained my power. The old man's Sino been putting the pressure on me. He sent someone to tell me I'm needed for some sort of project. Child alive! <laughs> project Stuja? Participating Sorry. in the plan will lose a lot of members in the process. Project Stuza. Project Stuza. Participating in the plan. A new enemy, and that doesn't even look like it's from Genshin. That looks like a whole different game right there. That looks like a whole different game. It kind of looks, it kind of looks like, almost like a Mary Ann's sort of like area. Everyone arguing over whether Farina or Nuvolet will get a second character quest. Turns out the real Hydra Archon was Sino Hobo. <laughs> Unless absolutely necessary, I will no longer carry out any special missions Shush. within Fontaine. Yeah, what is this music? It looks sick, though. Transfixed. Transfixed. That's the verse. That's crazy. Also, I noticed too, she's fighting special the actual like caterpillar. I mean, I don't know if it's Caterpillar exactly, but she's fighting an Animo Haley show. <laughs> so I just found that interesting. So, Within I don't know. Fontaine. Dire Bail Moon. You know, Staff of Homa? Within Fontaine. Oh, I'm, oh, it's just hers. I can't even see it. Transfixed. This looks like at the moon. ridiculous. An order. Fremine, what did you do? And who on earth is this? Ascended. Do you have any idea what you're doing? You're hiding the very person Father has been trying to find. I really didn't mean to drag anyone else into this. If Father finds out about Fremine, what did you do? <laughs> what did you do? These are the interesting th theories about uh, Caterpillar and Arlie might have similar origins. Oh, yeah, I could definitely see that for sure. This, everyone I've heard theories that, like, Arlequino is a hilly girl. Involved is going to be punished. Yeah. A traitor. Sino was chosen, but he was not the only one. You'd like me to return my power? I'm really looking forward to this rite of duels. The wisdom of Hermanubis would have been ours. Hmm. I want you to become Man, the next king of the house. Yet you seem to have different ideas. I'm not saying I have all the answers, but doing so will only bring us further what away from being a real king? family. You're the bell. <laughs> Words paint an optimistic picture indeed. Allow me to remind you, however, you are my oh, to sit from a glass. Oh, like Akron. We I'll make sure it's drained of all impurities and returned to its cleanest form. 
Good yeah. things mm. come to children who do as they're told. Oh, so I do hope please. you decide to tag along. There are many dangers ahead. And I, for one, don't intend to back down. Can, that, can we get that outfit? An order from father. So why? Why have oh, you that's the sight. No demonstration of loyalty shall go unrewarded. And no sacrifice shall be in vain. Dang. Let this be an actual boss fight, Hayo, please. I don't want to stand around and let a little helper do all the work. Can can we fight the boss? Please. I I would like to fight the boss. It's gonna work. Okay, now we've reached the part that I haven't seen anything past that point. Hello everyone. I'm Sarah Miller. But yeah, hopefully hopefully that's a boss that's kinda like a Raiden where we can actually fight them. Cruise, the voice of the female traveler Lumine. And hopefully well, not like a stall boss either. Welcome to the Genshin Impact version 4.6 special program. <laughs> Yay, welcome so Ido, why are you here? Yo, yo, welcome! <laughs> Okay, so I'm pretty sure that Why? everyone would agree that the House of the Hearth isn't an ordinary orphanage. But just in case you Let's needed any that. convincing, we've invited their voice actors to share some information with us today. Lenny. Hey everyone, my oh, name yeah, is Aaron is, uh... I'm the voice of Arlequino, the father of the House of the Hearth. You... The, the first that uh, Damon Mills gets a... Uh gets on here you might also recall that she's a fatui harbinger known as the knave i'm the knave. so thrilled to have been invited to the special program yeah hope well, they put the sparkle in her eyes while she already has the exes hi folks i'm damon mills the voice of linny and he's also a member of the house of the hearth yes he is yeah and although he's not a member of the House of the Hearth, we've also brought the harbinger of laughter and cheer, the one and only voice of oh. Arataki Ito. Oh, jeez. What up? It's me, <laughs> Max Middleman. Hey, everybody. What's going on? My bros, my guys, my dudes. Dude. So good. <laughs> Are you what? excited to be here? Vibes, vibes, vibes. <laughs> vibes for days. <laughs> All right. Well, without any further delay, vibes for days. let's start introducing the new content from version 4.6. I've heard that travelers will what be experiencing we got? new content related to the House of the Heart in the cats? upcoming version. Aaron, why don't you give us a rundown on what sort of organization the House of the Hearth is? Yes, it would be my pleasure. Based on the most recent intelligence Ooh. reports, the House of the Hearth is a Fatui intelligence organization Nanaku. operated by the Knave. Uh, it takes in children who no longer have a home due to all manner of reasons, and they receive an education <laughs> in a variety of disciplines. Naturally, at the same time as it this provides the base home, model for the children also take on various six other characters. Okay, this sounds like everything that we already know from the game. Uh, is there more news to hear? Yes, everyone knows that the House of the Hearth no. is a rather complicated orphanage, and the Knave, the fourth harbinger of the Fatui, is still hiding many unsolved mysteries. So how about we start diving into all the new information that we have about our Lakino? Definitely seems let's complicated. Do it. Yes, let's do it! Okay, okay, first, I, I want to hear it straight from y'all. What kind of person do you think the Knave is? Oh, no. Oh my gosh, I'm feeling a lot of pressure right now. <laughs> this is giving me all sorts of deja vu. I genuinely don't know how to answer um, that. I guess during the Fontaine Archon quest, I noticed that Arlequina was really skilled at directing the conversation. Her way of speaking was incredibly refined and polite, but... I mean, uh, did Sarah even get to the Fontaine Archon quest? <laughs> Aware. She was also incredibly intimidating. <laughs> I mean, remember how Farina pretended no, not did, to though. recognize her and talked about having nightmares? I totally get where she was coming from. Mm. But that's just an outsider's point of view, right? <laughs> what is the knave like as a parent? I think Damon is probably the best oh. person to answer that question. <laughs> okay, take it away. <laughs> okay, you know. were hoping that I would be the weakest link? Yeah. Well, <laughs> she's a very strict father. Okay. Uh-oh. Yeah. <laughs> strict. Father. Um, hmm. All right, it sounds like she gives everyone an intimidating impression. Yeah, but I think Arlequino loves all of the house's children equally, and she would never treat them harshly for no reason, though Surely. the kids feel a lot of pressure during her lessons and are often scared speechless by her stern attitude. It's probably for their own good. In an organization like the Fatui, these kids actually need to be more mature, tough, and patient than other children who are their age. It's you true. Know? Mm, 
That's actually kind of sad, though, isn't it? It is, yeah, yeah. Who hurt this knave? I want to know. Why are they this way? <laughs> so, actually, good question. Are you trying to say that she treats the kids like that because she was traumatized? Ooh, okay. Now, that's very sharp of you, oh, no. but let's keep our Lakino secrets hidden for just a little bit longer. Okay, okay. Um, I do have hmm. a question, though. Why did the children call her father? Ah, well, Let if be you're curious about Arlequino's past, then you'll have to find your answer in the game. That's fair. Her story quest, Ignis Purgatorius, will be released with version 4.6. Now, oh. I don't want to spoil anyone's gameplay experience by saying too much about her quest, okay? But I do hope that travelers will be able to appreciate Arlequino's unique charm after they've experienced yeah. her entire story. I like the constellation. <laughs> yeah. Picture. Version 4.6 will also introduce a new feature, the Focus Focused Experience, experience mode. mode. Now, if you use the feature while playing Arlequino's story quest, then it will minimize the number of times that you'll be- The child who doesn't exist. Oh, man. The fact that she's better than the previous Knave uh, makes me wonder what in the world was going down. Yeah. Interrupted by characters or oh, no. quest locations being allocated to other quests. Mm. So hopefully mm -hmm. this mode will help travelers have a better story experience, cool. you know? Nice. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. right. And in the future, this function will become available for more and more quests. Besides the that story quest, I'm Dem also Nukes. looking forward to hearing the Knave's voiceover lines because Aaron's kind of awesome. Yeah, <laughs> same. We'll finally be able to hear what she thinks about the other Harbingers, too. Yes, I selfishly Definitely also think agree that would be cool. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so, next, let's take a look at Arlequino's elegant yet deadly right, here we go. style. Here we go. <laughs> the intrigue. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. Staring into my eyes is ill-advised. I can't promise you'll like what you What see. in the world? Transfixed! Did he disappear? It's so red. It literally looks like it's out of, like, Bayonetta. Oh, what was that? This is where you fall. Is that part of our combo? Oh, oh, she's so cool. That was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> I like how she glides. Yes. Yeah. Well, yeah. Why was yeah, it? She's very elegant. Is that her like that was a perfect descriptor. Like elegant but deadly. New like glider. A, like a ballerina of death. Yes. Everything she does is okay, so like effortless. I'm lucky we lost after a razor. All right. Well, oh, if we're yeah. going to talk about Arlequino's oh, yeah. combat abilities, then we're gonna have. Dang, that is that's true. Huh? I didn't think about that actually. To talk about the bond of life mechanic. Uh, you might have been a victim to it while you were fighting elite Fatui operatives in Fontaine. Does anyone still remember yep. what a bond of life is? Uh, I like nobody no, used that you be for the entirety of abilities? Fontaine. Guys, you're too loud. Pipe oh. down. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Let's listen to what she has to say. <laughs> Wait, I, oh, I think you, I remember. Oh, you can see it clearly now. Yeah, that is indeed a sight. It's the red portion of the HP bar. When you have a bond of life active, it'll absorb any healing that your character receives. So they can't regain HP until the bond of life value has been healed. Yeah. Right. Yes. Right. Very good, <laughs> student. <laughs> when Arlequino <laughs> has a bond of life greater than or equal to a certain percentage of her health bar, her normal charged and plunging attacks will be converted to pyro damage, which can't be overridden by other elemental infusions. Oh, so and they're while like she's in this trying to like force bond of life. Date. Her normal attacks will consume a portion of her current bond of life to deal more damage and reduce the remaining cooldown on her elemental skill. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, but wait, the poem wait, doesn't actually. So you're saying that she'll deal more damage with her life. normal attack when her bond of life is higher? <laughs> Put simply, yes. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait That's a second. That's interesting, though. <laughs> no, wait. I get it. Wait, so it, it, Arlequino can give herself a bond of life, right? Yeah, I, I think so. What I mean, otherwise, happening? she'd have to chase down enemies who can put a bond of life on her. <laughs> Actually, that that sounds kind of funny. <laughs> also, how is she, like she's that. like standing in fire, and not burning. Uh, and that brings us to our elemental skill. Our Lakino skill doesn't just damage enemies; it also applies a blood debt directive to any enemy that it hits, which will damage them periodically. And when she uses a charged attack or her elemental burst, she oh. absorbs nearby blood debt directives. This That's also like some allows her Dark to obtain kind a of bond stuff. of life based on the number of directives. That it's she like absorbed. it's like her bond of life is like her mana or like her 
like power gauge. So don't worry, Max. Oh, I was very concerned. <laughs> I know, I know you were. Okay, hold on. That's creative, She can't though. regain HP until her bond of life is removed, right? So how does she stay in the fight? Well, after dishing out damage, Arlequino's elemental burst will oh, reset the shoot, cooldown wait. of her elemental skill and heal her based on her attack and her current bond oh, of life. Oh, no. She's right. Uh, okay. Also, thanks to one of her talents, while Arlequino is in combat, she gains bonus pyro damage, but also cannot be affected by any healing effects other than the healing provided oh, by her burst. Oh, no. Oh, so I mean, that seems like she's as ruthless to herself yeah, as she yeah. is to her mm. enemies. Like she oh, needs therapy. Probably. No. <laughs> <laughs> she's kind of it's a savage. Jover. I mean, <laughs> um, right. So Arlequino even has a special kind. Yeah, of but movement. then, if, but then if you heal, then you lose, you lose everything. Whenever she uses her charged attack, mm. right? Ooh, that looks perfect for. Oh, your dude, enemies. that's sick. Yeah, and for putting some serious. Pressure it doesn't even on look him. like yeah. it right yeah. now. <laughs> <laughs> dude, look at that scythe. Oh my god. She can't heal at all. Welcome to the, the niche game. Oh no, that's like you just can't be healed. So <laughs> get yourself a good shelter or get good. Yeah, no kidding. Uh huh. Oh, it's what about time heck? to introduce the event. I guess it, it's that it is creative though, because it makes sense, right? If you have bond of life, the only way to get rid of bond of life is to heal it off. So, if she gets her power from having Bond of Life, she basically would be a, a like a broken character. Not like broken like good, but like her kit wouldn't work if she healed it off, right? So, I guess she can't heal because then she'd lose her Pyro Infusion. Vent wishes in version 4.6. I mean, it is interesting, but dang, that is, that is like literal risk for reward gameplay. High risk. Uh, for reward gameplay, although I'm not entirely sure what the reward is, besides just like she has pyro infused attacks. As ready, oh, let's yeah. do it. Hmm. After freeing his healer meta, yeah, I just threw that completely out of the window. So good, yeah, good luck playing her with Farina. Oh, outside of her Q, okay. So you need to your Q can only so kind of kind of like Hu Tao, except she can heal, but Arlequino can't. Dang, that's yeah, that's interesting, but huh. Let's say about time to introduce the event wishes in version four point six. Ooh, dude, that's a good reference. Mask of Red Death. That's a um uh Edgar Allan Poe uh poem or like story. When she enters Mask of Red Death. That's yeah, that's a little that's a cool little reference there. I don't know what that means in terms of Arlequino, though. Is she the? Re I guess she's the Red Death. Yeah, that's a cool reference. Like, like uh, overall, that just kind of was like the "you can't escape death" kind of thing. Was the story? Like the it'll always reach you. So you guys ready? Oh, let's yeah. do it. And eventually, it reaches everybody. <laughs> During the first phase of version four point six. Yes. Yes. Arlequino, the knave, and Linny will both enjoy a drop rate boost. I was I was definitely peeping everything on this. I heard all the rumors about this one. It was either like uh, Baiju was mentioned, and I was like, please don't put him on the first half next to her. Please don't do that. Supposedly, Barbara C six also works. Oh, it, oh, it does work. Huh? Or like you know, Barbara and Chi Chi team. Uh, oh yeah, yeah. You might yeah, you might act, might actually come back with her kind of teams. No joke. Early fans the one, all new fans five star polearm crimson moon semblance will also become available. Dang. Also, wait, it doesn't look like a scythe though. Hey, what? The wanderer and Baiju will return Ugh. in the second phase, so be sure to keep an eye out. Yeah. Yeah, I see what you mean. Poor wanderer fans, man. Dang, wanderer has been absolutely screwed the last two times. Last time he reran, it was Kokomi, so he had that donut. Then he reran he reruns again next to a different donut. Literally two donuts in a row. If you want his weapon, yeah, good luck on that one. Yeah, no farina. No farina. Hey, oh I guess they figured they have anti-synergy, so <laughs> didn't put them together on this one. 
Farina not even mentioned. And Farina wasn't even in the trailer either. But can I be honest? Probably a good thing. Like, like lore wise, probably a good thing. If Rena needs a break, leave Rena alone. She just wants to relax. Oh my gosh, that's so amazing. <laughs> leave okay, her be. So, Aaron and Damon, do you have any other news yeah, you'd like no to Freena. share? <gasps> Actually, I do. <gasps> Let's discuss the new <laughs> weekly boss. Oh, that's my gosh. right. We were just Can talking we get about that how the Nave shows different faces to her family members and to outsiders. Oh, but in special circumstances, she will reveal another side. Why can't we get this one, Senora? <laughs> That's right. Are you ready to see a new name? Yes! I am ready! I'm ready. So ready. I feel like they shouldn't show this, but I guess you gotta show something. Oh, it turns into a scythe, I see. Yeah, that, that looks like a, a full-on fight. Ooh, the big old hand. The clones. Got that like vampire one wing thing going. Oh, never mind. That is sick. Oh, dang! What? In, what? In the, what? <laughs> There's nothing I love more than like gameplay demos. <laughs> Dude, just trying to show it off. Just jogging along. Yeah. Oh, wow. Wow. Like opera singer. Not even Linny and Fremine have seen Here this side of her before. Mm. So the name that is, is so accepting cool. challengers now? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my gosh. She's so elegant. That's, I'm, I'm very happy with that. Super duper dangerous. Yeah. She's so, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, it feels I, I, I literally said I was, I was waiting for another like human boss for a long time. Because we had the whale and all these big old bosses and Scaramouche. Like I was, I was waiting for like a human boss. And now we got one. Even more badass. Or what I expect to be human. Twice the badassitude. <laughs> hey, no it's cursing, not so simple to see Edo. the Nave's other side. She'll appear normally at first, as if she were giving you an ordinary dude, training dude, lesson waiting sick. to counter your attacks. Yeah, it seems like she'll even dodge hit her. all of our attacks <laughs> like a phantom if we're out of her immediate range. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It that feels is like sick. she's implying that we're all in the palm of her the hand. <laughs> I mean, you guys know what her personality's like. She doesn't want her children <laughs> crying or running away that from is, conflict. That is great. Instead, she hopes that they'll be able to take the initiative, even if their opponent Skills. is their own father. <laughs> the way they show us what she does when they travel her, is walking around doesn't help for the hype. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's just like... Do, 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 do. The outside world will not show her children mercy, so neither... Clear the bond of life and use a charge attack. Can she afford to be too forgiving to them? Mm. If you do not repay the blood debt directives the name mm. applies to you, all her attacks against you will be enhanced. But Ooh. if you applies to you, all her attacks against you will be enhanced. Dang, 24k gone. That's probably just like a one hit kill probably. But dang, dude. 24k gone in an instant. Reduce the atoms. But if you manage to outheal the bond of life, the knave will reward you for repaying this blood debt, and your charged attacks against her will be enhanced. Uh, uh, don't the bone wings? Oh my god, new blood blast! Like spiders. <laughs> yes, yes, that's it. <laughs> I like it. Oh my gosh! Yeah, it's like look she at all the mechanics. Of her prey while she watches so many different struggle ones. Struggle and closes the distance. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of. Probably uh, resistant to pyro damage, I'd imagine. Can't wait to die a lot. Creepy being the hunted. I just, I just, I'm just so glad we get to actually fight this boss. And for once, <laughs> <sighs> so, like it's okay, an actual okay, battle. Okay. I think we should stop the introduction here. <laughs> Let's leave some space for everyone to experience the challenge for themselves. It's too wait, late, guys. So it's too late. I know that many travelers will be too wondering much. about this. 
The Knave's boss form is tied to her story quest. Mm -hmm. Normally, players would have to progress the story to a certain point in order to participate in the challenge. Not but anymore. now we have a quick challenge feature for weekly Trounce domain bosses. Yeah! Ooh. As long as travelers are adventure rank oh, yeah. 30 or higher, they'll be able to challenge her directly Kinda takes by going to the adventurer handbook. The hype the out, but I'm glad the feature is there. Trounce domains and pressing Remedy. quick challenge. Wow. Oh, that's cool. That's a yeah. nice little shortcut to the battle. Yeah. yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm looking forward to that. I, I think it's important to have that. Like, it's still a good thing to have. Because people just want to love her, get her to 90 or get her talents up. But she's going to be like a 866 for like the first week. <laughs> that is really valuable information to have. And it also so, looks like it's be a my while. turn to deliver some news. Two new artifact sets will become available oh, yeah. in version 4.6. Unfinished Reverie and Fragment of Harmonic Whimsy. That does not sound... Anywhere with whim in it doesn't sound too strong. <laughs> it looked like uh, Sumeru-inspired artifacts, almost. Or like Ramiria. Fragment of Harmonic Whimsy and Unfinished Reverie. Travel they don't look like they pertain to any character, though. Those who are interested in them should stay tuned for more information. Cool. Oh, yes. Oh, you're finished. Okay, wait, how come your update was so short? It wasn't oh, enough for finished. me. Yeah, give us more. Okay, okay, I actually do have other news to share. Ooh. Uh, do you? Yes, 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 yes. In version 4.6, Sumeru City will be experiencing an unsolved mystery. Ooh. And for some reason, sign all the people to get for some reason. Wait, what? Sing an unsolved mystery. Ooh. And for some reason, Sino's gotten mixed up in it. Hey! Oh, I thought he was gonna say he has the second quest. Because that's what I was about to say. Like, out of everyone to get a second quest, Sino? Did you know about that? It, his picture is Wait. Is Sino the first? Character to actually get the second one? No, 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 no. It's not, I don't think so. Oh, oh, right. <laughs> I know, like Archons usually get a second one. Uh, Venti don't. We don't include a Venti, but <laughs> a normal <laughs> character. Well, Sino wanted to investigate personally because oh, yeah, someone involved yeah. in the case you're has a very it. unique identity, and the two of them share a close connection. That's true. Oh, it sounds like there's some serious shenanigans going That's on. That's right. Is this a case where we get to use violence <laughs> if the situation gets too complicated? Yes. Violence. These are all very good guesses, but it's a I'll Mario offer Galaxy you story quest. You probably wouldn't be able to guess otherwise. A mysterious youngster with. Ooh, dang. Mysterious youngster. It looks like he's gonna pierce through your soul. Now that looks like a Sumeru character. I like the way he looks. Or no, no, sorry. It looks like a, a Sumeru slash like Natland character. It looks like a character from the desert region. You know, With like born and raised. To the mystery will make his debut during the case. Hmm. And like his hair. Tino's friends are not just freeloaders who only show up for food. You say his name? Tainari, Kale, Alhatham, and Kave will all come to support him when he's in a pinch. So, yeah. Well, if man, you want to know. like he was like opposing him. More about what happens in this case than looks like He looks like if Kazuha and uh, Claude from Fire Emblem had a baby. Oh, actually, yeah. I think more characters get second story quests more frequently now. Yeah, I, I hope so. Sure to check out Sino's second story quest. I hope so. Lupus Arius Act Two. Travelers can venture to Sumeru and What's investigate the secrets lurking underneath the sands. In due time, of course. Hmm. <laughs> Sarah well, that'll be interesting. So it won't just be like a one quest kind of deal. You'll be getting his and Arlequino's. Are you totally delivered? That was great news. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Speaking of great news, mm. I think Damon also has wait. some important information wait, to share. Wait, 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 wait. <gasps> really? Wait, yes. wait, 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 what are we wait. waiting for? We've just presented too much information too quickly. C can we take a break? break. So digest oh, all of it, please. Damon, Get those codes. Please. They're already he gone. You can't keep getting away I with this. <laughs> Right. No, no, Damon, you're right. I Actually, let's check out no, the first there. redemption code before we continue introducing the oh, new content. That's what Ooh. I thought. <laughs> that was amazing. That's what was what it? I thought. Atho? Atho? <laughs> or no. Oh, Sethos. Sethos. What's the announcement? Zeno Robinson and Shoya Chiba. Oh, I've never heard of him so far. The, the VAs, but. Z Zethos. How much you want to bet he's a uh, Dendro? <laughs> Doesn't didn't mention that, did it? 
bro is beautiful. <laughs> the wisdom of Hernambius would been would have been ours. He looks very friendly. Don't look don't look like a bad guy. He seemed like he wanted to fight Sina though for a second. Sethos. He actually kind of looks like some of the artifact sets. <laughs> like the, the, all the gold pieces and whatnot. He looks like the DPC artifact set with like some yellow in there. So we yeah. plus one electro mail. Sin. Hey, welcome back everyone. So hey, Undersea Capital. Undersea Capital, the Lost Homeland. Told you the story of Arlecchino and the House of the Hearth. So, why hmm. don't we continue the story of Remuria, which you saw in the beginning of the program? Remuria. I would like this very much, please. <laughs> yes, you did such <laughs> a yes, good job. Yes. Encore, encore. <laughs> a new area of Fontaine will open in version 4.6. Travelers will get to visit the village of Petricorn. Mostly all water. <sighs> Though, Petricorn? would there even be much to see on such a small island? Well, yeah, I guess this is... Dang, this that one. just, like, looks like it'd be Natland. I'm supposed to really confidently say totally, right? It is, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, now that you've mentioned it, there's definitely Bird more Island. to this village than meets the eye, right? Yeah, I think we're focused on the wrong thing here. This is where the kingdom of Remuria's remains lay at rest. Oh, so how big was such a glorious and prosperous nation, really? Mm. Oh, well, now that you say Why that, is her this town looks uh, <laughs> a whole lot bigger. Now that's a neat trick. <clears throat> anyway, <laughs> this is where we'll meet a talking cat. With its guidance, we'll oh, be able to see the civilization. The cat coming back for another patch. What? Oh my gosh, uh, that's amazing. Anything for a talking cat. <laughs> As Aaron what mentioned the at the beginning of the program, King Remus composed a symphony, one with wondrous power that grants King the wishes Remus. of the human souls dwelling within. Yes, I'm getting it. I'm getting it. I'm I I actually I don't You're get it. You're so not getting it. That's okay. I will explain it in a few words. So you'll just have to learn about the symphony by going More on an Mosins. adventure with this little cat. I'll avoid spoiling the adventure itself, but you'll arrive you at did. the Remoria ruins with the cat. The kingdom's remnant slumber in the depths where the sunlight can't reach. You'll meet a dragon in the deep seas. <gasps> oh, so I was thinking that was not. So you'll be able to obtain no. powers relating to the symphony, which will help you explore the lost realm of Remuria. You'll be able to pause the melody within the realm of this ancient civilization. It's almost like the you flute. You can weapon. also unseal time in places where it stopped. So oh, these cool. powers will let you interact with Stop specific time? objects in the ruins. <laughs> You know, that might be useful for solving puzzles during your adventure. Totally. Ooh. Meanwhile, a forgotten statue sits in a recess. Oh, that was a boss? I thought it was just a normal dude, like a normal enemy. Statue of marble and brass. Yeah, that just, I thought it was like a normal enemy. Faded castle, silently proclaiming huh. the immortality and glory. Oh, is it really? of a great the civilization yeah. it awaits a warrior who would dare challenge the Zeus. majesty of the ancient ruler oh yeah that's right the statue of marble and brass will oh this is probably our looking those boss mats as yeah. a boss you can earn all sorts of materials if you manage to beat it in a challenge yeah. <laughs> i'm so hyped for it <laughs> oh too. my gosh yes okay. and damon you did such a great yes, job with introducing it that was great <laughs> that was great yeah. damon wait but real quick quick question yeah, yeah that's a even normal get to such a remote little island that is a great question travelers who have Show already now. completed the third act of the oh, archon no. quest song of the dragon and freedom will automatically unlock a teleport waypoint in the Ooh, village okay. of petricor hopefully oh. this helps travelers with exploring the new area i Easy heard clap. that this feature will return for many new areas in the future uh, so excited i know so cool Just <laughs> all right, right over there that's no all problem. the information that we have about fontaine for now and now outside of the region <laughs> dot, dot, dot. <laughs> it seems like a new style of rock and roll is getting popular in inazuma rock and roll oh yeah. no <laughs> all right let's oh, no. all take a short break before we get into the next section Take a look at today's second redemption code. Oh no, what does this mean? What are they insinuating? Okay, I hear that a musical tour is coming to Inazuma and the organizer is none other than Arataki Ito oh, it's himself. <laughs> oh, Max, would you like to tell us more about it? it hey, Frigoro. Be my absolute pleasure, compadre. 
So I he's, got a question. Does here. everyone still remember Dvorak? Mm -hmm. Of course. Dvorak. He participated in last year's Lantern Rite, mm -hmm. right? That's oh, right. Yeah. Both Hu Tao and Shin Yen performed there. That's Ooh. right. And this time, it's an epic tour for the ages, organized mm. by none other than Ito and Dvorak. Oh, oh my gosh. And even the and concert Ito. name sounds really epic. Yeah, oh, does. yeah. No, the way he oh, says. Oh, we finally are getting the iridescent tour. Zinian's been talking about that forever, and we finally get to actually, like, see one. Iridescent Arataki rockin' for life toward the force of awesomeness really gives off the feeling of rock and roll. Wow. Wow. And the theme of this concert is about life. Specifically, hmm. it's about a brave puppy who saved the lives of- Hey, nice. So is that you're at C5? Everything is planned. Oh, that, you as well? Wow, it's both? Both at C, C, both C5 Goro? Countless other creatures on the- There you planet. go. Aww. So you just see six doors. I'm really yeah. looking forward to it. <laughs> yeah, me too. I really hope hmm. the Music Festival of Life will inspire everyone to unleash their own the rock and theme. roll spirit. Yeah. And I'll let you in on a little secret. Ito himself will personally be performing on the big stage. <gasps> Spoiler! What? Oh my gosh, that's gonna be awesome. Nice. Yes, it will be. And here's more exclusive news big for you. Dvorak will be giving away a brand new hey, musical we're playing instrument a horn. to our travelers called the Nightwind Horn. Ooh. Hmm. So if you enjoy playing music in real life, or especially if you or enjoy playing games. music in the game, be sure to check it out. I'm looking forward to seeing more amazing performances from all the great musicians out there. Are you now? Well, since you're so excited about it and the festival, why that? don't you help launch the Arataki Rockin' for Life tour? Oh, and walk to Simi Island. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there's three steps to preparing for the festival. Hmm. Number one, extreme oh. carnival ensemble. We can practice getting into the flow with some is rhythm fourth games one? while the stage is still coming together. Wow, those keys like are really Like the Lenny theme. Unique. Yeah, yeah they the really Lenny are. Theme. And the second task is called the Trillion Trinket Trawl. Hmm. Say that three times fast. The Trillion Trinket Trawl, the Trillion Trinket Trawl, the Trillion Trinket Trawl. <laughs> I did it. Ooh. We can't have <laughs> a rock and did. music festival without a rock and venue. So, Travelers will be helping Dvorak spruce it up with Picking his list some of items. It's a piece of cake, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And lastly, <laughs> we have the meeting of melodies. Can't That's have Leo. a party without adoring fans, so we got to invite fellow music lovers to come jam with us. After what? listening to their tunes, we can restore the missing music notes. Oh. So we'll be able to hear them sing. That is super oh, exciting. Oh man, that's yeah. gonna be funny. Yes, that's the point. <laughs> music gets you pumped. And after we've rocked out to the Pierce, I hope they have like some really awesome like and Inazuma over in Mondstadt. Clumsy singers. To a tense and thrilling tune. <gasps> hold up, hold Ooh. up. What do you mean by tense and thrilling? Does it mean anything? Just if need I a, a woodwind instrument to, to make an orchestra. Yeah. Say. The wind wind trace. Piece. Seekers hey, and strategy will has I finally arrived. Finally be able to play Wind Trace on my own account. Yes! I love Wind Trace. It's and and yeah, it can get a little tense at times. <laughs> well that the new name implies that the game has undergone Seekers some mechanics strategy. changes. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, you're correct. That's very intuitive of you. Thank yeah, you. you'll be playing hide and seek as rebels and hunters, just like before. But there are a few new rules. Ooh. Yeah, oh, when rebels are captured this? for the first time, they'll be exiled to the surveillance zone for a short period of time. Don't now, jinx it. <laughs> they will be automatically freed Actually, after the yeah. timeout, but also their friends can try to help them escape the zone early. But if you get sent to jail twice, you're, you're done. Permanently deleted from the game. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh, that does sound tense and thrilling. <laughs> right? And that's not all. Hmm. Oh no, each round will have six signaling devices, which will prevent nearby rebels from disguising or concealing themselves. I'm glad they updated the rebels it a little bit. The goal is to repair these devices Hacker while means. also avoiding capture. Once they repair four devices, they win the match. Oh, and rebels can work together okay. to repair these devices. And hunters will either need to prevent the rebels from repairing the signaling devices, or they can simply eliminate their opponents. If you fun. team up with friends, then Win watching trace. these games should be a blast. <laughs> ah, she gets it. She gets it. But the next part Fastest is even fingers. more thrilling. What? When rebels are fixing a signaling device, the device being repaired will enter the high-speed signaling state. What does it mean? It means it'll give off a light visible by every player in the area. Mm, in you're fact, gonna be a by the device that. will even be marked on the minimap. Ooh, okay. You know what? Yeah, that's a good point. It actually is a lot more like uh, Dead by Daylight, actually. So like we should like fix the the engines. 
There should be like a button where you can like mess up and then you, you so mess up the thing. that means that repairing the devices will expose your location. Oh, oh my gosh. It really <laughs> it's is these by sort of unexpected risks that can be the most nerve wracking. Mm -hmm. This is going to be super interesting to play. Yeah. yeah. Oh, absolutely. And mm. in another event, travelers will receive a rather Specially strange commission. What do you search. mean rather strange? What I mean mm. is there's... And he wants to make friends with a pyro regisfine. Oh uh. boy. Oh yeah, and not just a pyro register. So that's gonna he end well for you. Also wants to befriend a primo geovision and a jade plume terror shroom and the millennial pearl seahorse. This guy's uh, trying to collect Pokemon. The first time, <laughs> yeah, I thought you would react this way. Any it's trying to collect Pokemon. Anyway, a chef recently returned from a trip to. Yeah, to activate something while the other person. Oh yeah, yeah. Now it's a different character. And he started getting some ideas. Hmm. He thought he should toughen himself up by having oh, yeah. his own companion. You know, just like how people from Natlon have Saurian companions. Natlon? That makes sense. Mm -hmm. They have what like companions? how people from Natlon have Saurian companions. People from Natlon have Saurian companions? By having his own companion. You know, just like how people from Natlon... I see their warriors dress in imitation of their Saurians. Lon have Saurian companions. That makes hmm. sense. Mm -hmm. Kind of. Wait... Did like you dragons? say that he came back from yeah, that Yeah, dragon long? friends. Listen, listen, huh. Damon. If you want to oh, know the okay, details, okay. go check out the event <laughs> when the virgin is live, <laughs> all right? But for now, it's time for me listen, to introduce Damon. the gameplay. Oh, okay, all right, all right. Okay. Here you. All right, you got it. <laughs> you got In it. In this challenge, you can adjust the difficulty one. and your negotiation strategies. If you've got Oh, gun, I'm dumb. I don't even realize that, that, that this is what it was. It's like the Vagabond of it. So then you can take on fearless difficulty. You can also talk to hmm. Ranjit to adjust the number of negotiation strategies. So if you reduce yeah. them... It Damn, they really saved the good stuff for the uh, for this one, huh? They really did. Wind Trace. Um, the other one, we'll see how it, how it goes, but I definitely enjoy these. Amps up the challenge difficulty, giving you the perfect opportunity to like test your skills. Like boss rush. Cool. Both kind of active ones. strategies and long-term strategies are available. You can trigger active strategies at will. However, your opponent's hmm. HP and level will change depending on the number of strategies that Ooh, you've picked. That's cool. So, oh, yeah. So you've got to choose your favorite strategies to come out on top. Play to your strengths. Wow. Noted. And moving on, Noted. travelers should be familiar with our next event, Vibro Crystal Applications. Ooh, it seems like the event involves this one, but it goes by pretty quick. vibrating crystals in order to generate different effects. Aaron, I am so impressed by how intuitive you are. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that means that so much incredible. coming from you. Oh, <laughs> yeah, well, I meant it. Each round requires two teams. Before each okay. battle, you can set up Vibro Crystal Harmonics plans. Trial characters, teams. Paul. This will allow you to receive different combat buffs when you combine transmitter crystals and receiver crystals. Hmm. Basically, the transmitter crystal decides the trigger condition, while the receiver Look crystal at that determines team. the buff that your team gets as a result. Shining Zhao, Ganyu, and Raiden. combinations, you can create varying harmonic effects. It's your custom buff plan. Wow. Spot on, Saramela Cruz. Thank you. And <laughs> you gain a oh, harmonic I didn't even realize for each said. time that you trigger a harmonic effect. You can get even more combat bonuses if you accumulate enough harmonic points. Each challenge will have... What is going on there, man? <laughs> Combat bonuses if you accumulate enough What is harmonic. going on? He popped a shiny and burst and then started plunging with Zhao without the burst. Points. Each challenge will have oh. different trial characters. So you can choose... Well, it's fine if like you're in a Bennett circle. You could do like vape Zhao, but... Harmonic buff that works best for your team setup. Ooh, Be sure to maximize your points if you want to exchange them wait, wait. for rewards. Maximize. Nice. I mean, also, that sure is a team. Oh man. The genius invocation. Hey, we got Kuki and Farzan and the PCG bosses. event, the Forge Realms Temper, will be returning in version 4.6. This should be three. The heated yeah. battle mode will also receive an update, so don't miss out, duelists. <laughs> And there's going to be an overflowing mastery quick. event, so you can more easily train up the characters who need mastery. the extra boosty boost. <laughs> oh my gosh, thank you so much, Max. Okay. You just did an amazing yes. job. That was impressive. Thank you, Sarah. Mm -hmm. oh, and thanks, yes. since you introduced so many events in one go, Let's I take feel a like break. you deserve a little...
Welcome back, everyone. Uh, Next up, we're presenting here? some no. information about improvements for different in-game systems. Nice. First up, ah. we have we some updates knew. for the Serena teapot, such as the quick obtain feature. I guess the dev Instead notes of having will always to navigate be a bunch of menus, you up. can use this feature to put all missing furnishings into a queue. It won't ever really where be you like can a use special one click to purchase any missing live stream and then craft your desired thing. piece. Wow. Ooh, that does actually sound very convenient. So <laughs> convenient, so convenient. You don't the use avatar it. system will Me. also be updated, so you'll all be right, able all to right, use, let's see here. use more. What do we got? We got the Sakura cleansing quest. We got Nico, I'd imagine. We got Rue. Uh, which one is that one? Is that like an OG one? We got the one, the, yeah, the girl from the Chasm. The Aranaras, Jet. For portraits of you. Lilupar. Your familiar friend. So Rush. Pashiv. Uh, oh, the Anne, the Mary Ann one. And Caterpillar. Is that like a, a Fortress Merope kind of thing? I'm not sure what the, that S. As your and then another. Uh, oh, that was just a, a Molesine before. That's a Pishi at the end. Profile display. Let's see. Oh, okay. That's fun. Oh, that mask is Hanachiru Sato. Original head priestess of. Yep, okay. So, yep, isn't it? Mm hmm. Oh, and there's Arama you and bet. the Thunderbird, Thunderbird and the boy. And <gasps> oh, I was on Konami. Okay. And more is amazing. So <laughs> many more. I'm sure lots of travelers like them. Treasure yeah. compasses wow, have that's, also that's nice. been updated. Nice its to meet markers you. will be displayed on both the large map and the mini map. The compasses will also include okay. information about so different the map layers. Sweet. Oh, that's way more yeah. intuitive. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's time there to you go. Yeah, yeah. All the maps with 99% exploration progress. Heck yeah. Oh, the puzzle and fun thing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Exploration! Oh, yeah. Eradication! <laughs> yes. Now that we've gone over some updates to the game systems, it's time to talk about some Genshin Impact soundtrack news. <laughs> Let's go oh, no. music! Yeah, that's right. Let's Genshin Impact's third Fontaine OST, Cantus Eternus, will debut during version 4.6. This album right. features original music created by the Hoyo Mix team for the new region of Fontaine and related content. Oh, yeah! Yes. Yes. Music is my favorite! So hyped. <laughs> Oh no, y'all! It looks like there's nothing left for us to present. No. I know, yes. I know. So I think that means it's time for this special program to come to. Mm, there's a lot of time left. Oh, no. it's not so. Is there anything else that y'all would like to share with ooh, all the ooh, travelers ooh, who ooh. are watching? Yes. We will see you all in game. See you guys in the game. Love you. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, what? Oh, what? I thought maybe there was a to see. there was gonna be a little teaser there, but yeah, it does it does look good. We have a g pretty good banner. We have uh oh well, well good banner for the first half. <laughs> Poor wander weapon. Wander buys you second phase, so it's gonna be a easy skip. And then the first side is just gonna be Arlequino as a new character. You're gonna have this thing. Crimson Moon Semblance uh, next to Lenny's polearm, or Lenny's polearm, Lenny's uh, bow. Crimson Moon Semblance will also become And available. I guess it'll turn also, into a scythe. the Wanderer and Baiju will return in the second phase, so be sure to keep an eye out. I wonder out. why Wanderer. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so amazing. <laughs> okay. We got the Arlequino boss battle, which actually looks very good. Um, The artifacts... Some pictures. <laughs> We're at one point six out of ten live stream. Oh yeah, the lot yeah, the four stars I want. I hope I hope Chevy's on there. If not, then I mean if not, then I'll just I just hope it's like a new character with Chevy. You know, just please don't put Chevy on like a character who was previously out. That's like the only thing. For me. <laughs> yeah, give us more We got a Sino story going. quest. Alright, is this the case where we get to use violence? <laughs> We get to right, see Ramiria yeah. or remains of Ramiria. Got a horseman boss fight. Got more. We got a music musical like rhythm event again. Osu. Uh, wind trace. The vagabond event. I call it vagabond. That's just like one of the names it was. Verbo crystal TCG. <laughs> and most importantly, 
This is definitely going to be a uh, a skill issue character, for sure. Or just have a shield. So if you use Farina, you're literally going to be at half health and take damage from enemies. It's going to be rough. I'm so happy though, because I've always wanted this. I've always wanted a normal attack centric character. That's Pyro. That's melee. Because like there was Yui Mia. But sometimes, you know, like the way she attacks, it can, it can be, it wasn't exactly what I was looking for. Hu Tao was great, but, but it's, it's like the, it's all about the charge attacks. And then there's like Yan, Fei, and Klee where they're like catalysts, where they have like, you know, one's throwing bombs and one's kind of like range a little bit. But this is actually a normal attacking pyro character. Oh, and that too, I didn't even notice that. Is that, wait, is it, is it a mark on them? That seems like she's as ruthless. Yes, thank you. Years ago, I said, if Arlequino will be a playable character, please, please, please give her an, give her an ability where she does an X, uh, like X marks the spot. And I actually followed through. <laughs> That's all I wanted from Arlequino was just X marks the spot. That's all I wanted. I, I was saying it, I wanted it to be like called that, like the name. But the names are already, we already have like a, a book reference anyway, so that's even better. And that's the thing too, like, yeah, Arlequina really, she really like fit a lot of things that I wanted her to. Um, I was talking about how Farina has her charge attack, how like it actually changes her kit. And it's not just like a, a hard hit. It's actually like a, a thing that does something. And I was like, I, I hope they do that with more characters. And here we are. Not not this, but just like the fact that her charge attack absorbs the blood debt directive. Yeah, charge attack flying. That's kind of like Nouvellet, but it's actually made for travel. So yeah, I wonder if it's like riding Shogun, where it's like you fight her until her health bar depletes when she's normal, and then she. Oh, you know what? I think I think it is. It is. It is. It is. Her opponent is their own. Okay, I'm not gonna say 100, percent but she's called, her, her name is the ne the knave fourth of the two harbingers right now, and then when they cut to the, the next screen, it's Cinder of Two Worlds Flames. So probably like a whole transformation cutscene goes up in the air, it does the whole animation, and the means like. <gasps> world will not show her children mercy. That kind of so thing. Neither can she afford to be too forgiving. Like with child or. Um, Scaramouche. I, I was just hoping, like, is it going to be like an age now kind of thing where people have like a, a gate on their health? To them. If you do not repay them, yeah, the floor breaks and then you fall down, and then Paimon's like, get up. The blood debt directive <laughs> applies. He knows but it's kind of cool though. It's like you you get your bond of life, and now you kind of have like power for a bit, and then once you lose it, you're out. And that's loud, this is an, an idol. <laughs> oh, does she have the Nahida idol? Are you gonna be teaching us about her abilities? Guys, I think she loud. does. Uh, Yo, wait, are you gonna be teaching us? Also, about her, can her ability? someone explain why there's one behind her too? There's somebody playing co-op and there's two Alakinos. But yeah, I think she has a Nahida uh, idol, where Nahida's idol is like permanent. Where if you just let her just sit, she'll just sit on that swing forever long. Um, unless you move again. And I could be wrong, but this looks like it's like that. It looks like it's like a Nahida, like permanent style idol. Does she like bring them in? Oh my gosh, she does. She yanks them in with the same. It does like the Scorpio. Get over here. He actually brings them in. We got grouping, and she's not animo. No. Uh, you, might have you know, why, does, ability. why doesn't the, uh, like, Chinese or Korean artists ever get any love? They always show the English and the JP. and never show their own native language, which would be Chinese or, or Mandarin. And I'll put the CN one there. Star Rail does. Star Rail does all four of them. Then. What are you trying to say there, Genshin? So charge attack. Even has Time a special it. kind of movement whenever she uses her charged attack, mm. right? Ooh, that looks perfect for scaring your enemies. Yes. 
Yeah, and for putting some serious pressure on them. Yeah. Ooh, that's yeah. closer to like <laughs> maybe five seconds. Uh -huh. Almost, oh, almost it's double. About time to introduce the event. Hmm. Then again, we don't know if she, if she ran out or if they just stopped. 